Hey everyone, welcome back to this job with class. So today I am going to tell you the application of the complex numbers. So let us see the main application of those numbers is to represent periodic motions such as the water waves, alternating current, light waves, etc. Argument of Z. This is the angle between the line joining Z to the origin and the positive real direction, which is denoted by small letter ARG of Z. Modulus of Z. This is very important for in examination also they will ask you for finding the modulus of Z. This is the distance of Z from the origin and which is denoted by mod Z. Let us see how to find the modulus of Z. So the formula for that is square root of x square plus y square. See the example here if Z is equal to 6 plus a child then what about the modulus of Z that is nothing but so here x is equal to 6 and y is equal to 8. Therefore x square is 36 and y square is 64. Sum of that is 100 and square root of 100 which is nothing but what? 10. So mod 10 mod z is equal to 10 here. So here some identities are there. Uh, something like 12 identities are there. So that you have to keep remembering these things and it will get help to you for solving the problems. Is 0 a complex number? Definitely because 0 is a real number and also we know that we can express any real number into complex number. So 0 can be written in the form of 0 plus 0i. So therefore 0 can be represented in the form of complex number. Hope you like this video. See you in our next video. Until then take care. Bye. Have a nice day.